Let's feel his emotion. They're off, Lord Stormont on the inside, tries for the lead, Baltic back towards the outside, second take chances along the rail, third with Captain Claude, fourth, a gap uh, two lengths, Mac Sorley, fifth, and four lengths back to Smiling Seth, sixth, around the turn down the back stretch, Lord Stormont in front by two lengths, Baltic bet second, two and a half lengths back to take chances, third, a gap of two more lengths, Captain Claude, fourth, Three lengths back to Mac Sorley, fifth. Quarter times, 30 seconds flat. At the paddock turn the first time, Lord Stormont maintaining a two length advantage. Baltic bet second, take chances third. Two and a half lengths back to Captain Claude, fourth. Mac Sorley up on the outside, fifth. As they come by the stands the first time, Lord Stormont shows away by a length and a half. Captain Claude has gone off stride. Baltic bet second, take chances third. Max Soli fourth, three lengths back to Smiling Seth fifth, or back to Captain Claude sixth. Half times one minute and four fifths. Around the clubhouse turn the final time. Lord Stormont in front by two lengths. Baltic bet second, two lengths back to take chances third. Gap two and a half lengths. Mac Soli fourth, Smiling Seth fifth. Straining out down the back stretch. Lord Stormont now leads by three lengths. Baltic bet second. Three and a half lengths back to take chances. Third gap for two and a half lengths. Mac Sawley fourth. Captain Claude moves up along the rail. Fifth. Three quarters. One thirty and three. Around the far turn. Lord Stormont still in front. By a length and a half. Baltic bet second. Two lengths back to take chances. Moving to the outside. Third. They approach the head of the stretch. Lord Stormont still in front. By a length and a half. Baltic bet trying to close along the rail second, take chances third. Through the stretch, Lord Stormont leads by three points of a length. Baltic bet on the rail second. Lord Stormont and Baltic bet. Lord Stormont in front. Introducing the unofficial winner, number one, Lord Stormont. By the Stormont Meadows of Long Salt, Ontario, Canada, trained by Norm Jones, driven by Doug Brown. First elimination of the Yonkers Trot has gone official. 3.30, 2.10, and out. 1.3, very popular number. Two favorites, even $6. We'll take a look at the very happy contingent in the winner's circle, Doug Brown. Session manager here at Yonkers Raceway, Steve Bubba White, joining us in the winner's circle. We will step aside. There you see the mutuals. 1.32, triple, by the way. $22.50. Doug Brown posing for the illustrious lens of... Woodbiney, the, the ch last chart line from Woodbiney, he beat a bunch of older horses and, and beat them real handy from off the pace. So, and he's raced in front on the smaller tracks. So uh, it really doesn't matter to him what kind of track he's on. He's so handy on the turns and, and on the big tracks. He's got a little stamina to carry him through the stretch there. So he's, he's just a real handy little horse. So we'll see you back here next Friday. And I hope so. <laughs> okay, Doug Brown, Lord Stormont winning our first Yonkers Trot elimination. Congratulations to both horse trainer Norm Jones. The Stormont Meadows and Mr. Brown will look at the full race replay. Race number 10, the second try to limb goes in 14 at 10.52.